Right, the Wall and Fire Stayers Handicap, a marathon two mile five race, yeah, on the dirt at Kempton. So, 0 to 85 handicap for three olds and up. One is Maiden Brumier for David Robertson, the top weight. Two is Validation Joshua Sutherland. Three, Immortality for Satyam. Four, Maiden Mate Fantastic Thomas Rogers. Five is Only Hard Alex Cherry. Six, David Coverdale Martin Needham. Seven, Takita Namika Alex Cherry. Eight is Durable Obi Wan. And nine and ten from the James Shea Stable, Alamo Riva and Aunt Polly. That's the start. And away they go. Maiden Ramirez got a good start, but as quickly it's Immortality for Satyam who goes up to lead them. So Satyam's Immortality goes up to lead from validation for Josh Sutherland in those red and black stripes. Also right there is Only Hyde in the orange season cap for uh, Alex Cherry. Just behind that, Alamo Reba for James Shea. Then comes David Coverdale with Durable. Then Maiden Brumier for David Robertson. Oh, that one's outside. It's Takita Namika. Behind that is Aunt Polly. And then May Fantastic in the darker green colors of the light green sleeves for Thomas Rogers at the back of the field. There's only about 9 or 10 lengths from first to last as Immortality takes him along for Satyam in front. Two lengths clear of only Eyed in second with validation on that one's outside. Then comes a David Coverdale for Martin Leedham. On that one side, Ale on the and side's inside is Alamo Reva between horses at Durable that looks uh, like Obi Wan's colours. Followed by Takita Namika for Alex Cherry. On the rail is uh, Made in Bermia for David Robertson. Travelling four wide on Polly and then Made Fantastic at the back of the field. Immortality for Satyam leads as they go out on the second circuit from. Uh, Validation in second, then comes Only Hard for Alex Cherry. Three lengths back to Alamo Riva for James Shea. On that one's outside is David Coverdale in the red colours for Martin Needham in between the two. Durable for Obi Wan. Three lengths back to Maiden Ramia and the grey horse with the blue and purple stripes for David Robertson. The red Ste Dolphin Steves in cap. On that one's outside is Takita Namika, then Made Fantastic in between horses for Thomas Rogers. And the other green coloured horse is on Polly for James Shea. It's about eight lengths off this leader, which is is all mortality and Satyam's front running immortality takes him along. Validation for Joshua Sutherland back in second. The grey horse on that one's inside is uh, only hard for Alex Cherry. Then comes Durable for Obi Wan on that one's outside is David Cavadell for Mark Needham on the rail. Is Adam Marie for James Shea and then follows Maiden Bremier for David Robertson with a second Alex Cherry horse to keep in the on that one's outside. Moving closer, trying to move closer, made fantastic for uh, Thomas Rogers and that one's outside is on Polly for James Shea. Okay. So Immortality still takes them along as they come into the straight for the second time. And we'll, it'll, it's the second last time as they approach the straight for the second time. And we're, and we're about to go off on their final circuit as Immortality leads and Validation in second. Then comes Only Eyed, Durable just behind that. Uh, on that one's outside, David Coverdell and uh, Mate Alan Mariva has also always been with those two. Travelling really well behind it, made in Bermuda for David Robertson on the Edmunds outside, Takita Namika for Alex Cherry. Then comes on Polly and made fantastic, so looks on from the rear of the field, but only about seven or eight lengths off this leader, which is still immortality as they go off on their final circuit. So they pass the winning post for the penultimate time and immortality leads from validation now clear second only hides back in third the grey horse then comes David Coverdale for Martin Leedham with the red colours on that one's inside Alamo Riva for James Shea uh, Durable has dropped back and Raiden Brunet is on that one's inside then comes to Keaton and Mika made fantastic is past one the one he's past is on Polly being pushed along at the back of the field for James Shea so immortality is still the leader as they go down the far side of the track from validation in second only hides back in third uh, moving up into that one's outside is durable. David Coverdale trying to get closer but it's gone wide the whole way and that's probably going to tell later on. Alamo Reeves on the rail. Maiden Bermier has uh, switched outside to try and move closer. Then three in the line on Polly to Keaton Namika and made fantastic at the back of the field. To Keaton Namika looks like it's starting to struggle. Five furlongs left to travel. Immortality for Satyam still the leader from the strong travelling validation strong travelling validation in second. In between horses being pushed along only hard. Durable's also starting to be pushed along back in third. Maiden Bermier going well enough back in the uh, fifth place then comes uh, improving made fantastic on that one's answer David Coverdell has dropped back then comes um 
to Keaton and Mika and on Polly is the trailer. Three firms left to travel. Immortality still the leader. Three lengths clear. Validation moving forward strongly but travelling really well back in third is made in Brumier for David Robertson. Only Ardy Stone to struggle. Duables going backwards. The rest are quite far out of the ground. It's Immortality the leader for Satyam. From Validation for Joshua Salamat. Made in Brumier is finishing very powerfully for David Robertson. Now switch to the centre of the track. It's Immortality from Validation with Yak comes Made in Brumier for David Robertson. It's only a matter of time for Made in Brumier. Hits the front and Made in Brumier. The grey horse has gone clear for David Robertson. Going to win the two mile five stays handicapped. Made in Brumier wins from Validation in second. Then came the long time leader Immortality. And running off in the back of the field, Thomas Rogers made fantastic. Was never dangerous back in fourth though. Comfortable winner for David Robertson. Came from near the back and wins without the jockey doing much in front. Second place was Validation for Joshua Sutherland. Third was Immortality for Satyam. Quite a long way back to the fourth horse, which was um, made fantastic for Thomas Rogers. Tikita Namika never threatened for Alex Cherry back in fifth place.